Hey there, everybody. I'm Adriana Hopkins with 7 News DC, coming to you from the Prince George's County Memorial Library System. On Tuesday at 5 p.m., enjoy a movie night with the family with the film Moana at the Glen Arden Branch Library as PGC MLS continues to celebrate Asian Pacific American Heritage Month. On Wednesday at 6 p.m., local author Nikki Payne will be at the Greenbelt Branch Library for a book signing and discussion on her novel Pride and Protest, a fresh and modern retelling of Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Protest sees a woman go head to head with the CEO of a corporation threatening to destroy destroy her neighborhood. Also at 6 p.m., the Friends of the Largo Kettering Branch Library will host a lively book discussion on Kindred by Octavia Butler. Thursday at 5 p.m., the new Carrollton Branch Library will host the Money As You Grow Book Club, a financial education program for parents and caregivers of children from ages 3 to 8. This program encourages adults as they assist their children in developing new skills through interactive reading and family activities. On Thursday at 7 p.m., PGC MLS and the Prince George's County Office of Human Rights are partnering to present a virtual discussion with Dr. Julia Lee on her book, The Racial Railroad. Railroad. This title explores the surprisingly central role that the railroad has played and continues to play in the formation and perception of racial identity and difference in the United States. Pride Month kicks off this week and PGC MLS has an awesome lineup of events to celebrate the LGBTQ plus community in Prince George's County. On Saturday from noon to 4 p.m., PG Parks and the Hinesville Branch Library are proud to host the In the Life LGBTQ plus Pride Celebration. Then at 1 p.m., learn how to create a digital family tree with the Prince George's County Genealogical Society at the Laurel Branch Library. At 2 p.m., Akakeek Branch Library is hosting their PGC MLS Summer Prince George's Kickoff. Drop in and help create a collaborative art project for display in the library. That's it for us this week. Thanks for watching and let us know how you're celebrating Pride Month in the comments. Have a great rest of your week. See you back here next week.